BYD Yon Wan U9, the supercar that jumps. Supercars have always been about speed, style, and dominance. Ferrari, Lamborghini, Bugatti, these names define the game. But now, a new challenger has entered the arena. Not from Italy, not from Germany, but from China. This is the BYD Yon Wan U9, a car so radical, so unexpected, that it doesn't just break the rules, it rewrites them. And today, we dive deep into the story of the world's first jumping car. Faster than your imagination, tougher than any roadblock, and more revolutionary than any supercar ever been. And that's exactly what BYD wants the world to do. Look up at China's new supercar brand. The U9 isn't just another electric car, it's a statement. A billion-dollar project designed to put China's auto industry toe-to-toe -to -toe with Ferrari and Bugatti. But here's the twist, this isn't only about speed. The U9 is about defying physics itself. The technology behind the beast. At the heart of the Yanwang U9 is BYD's e-platform, a breakthrough system that gives the car four independent electric motors. Think about that. Each will has its own dedicated motor. That means insane control instant torque, split-second adjustments, and power you can literally feel under your fingertips. Together, these motors deliver over 1,300 horsepower. That's Bugatti territory. And the acceleration? 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in just 2 seconds flat. That's quicker than a Tesla Plaid. Quicker than most hypercars on Earth. But then comes the feature no one saw coming. Dysasex Intelligent Body Control System. A suspension so advanced, it doesn't just absorb shocks, it creates them. This system allows the U9 to rise, tilt, bounce, and yes, jump. Imagine a supercar literally hopping over obstacles, dancing on command, and dodging road hazards like something out of a sci-fi movie. No Ferrari can do this. No Bugatti can even dream of it. The first jump. During its reveal, BYD showed the U9 bouncing in place like a lowrider on steroids. The crowd gasped. This wasn't a gimmick. This was engineering at its most playful, most futuristic form. Why does this matter? Because this ability isn't just for show. It means the car can adapt to harsh terrain, avoid scraping on speed bumps, or even lift itself during emergencies. In other words, the U9 is not just a supercar. It's a survival machine. More than a supercar. From the outside, the U9 looks like a beast forged in a wind tunnel. Aggressive curves. Futuristic headlights. Aerodynamics designed for war. Inside, it's luxury mixed with sci-fi digital dashboards, AI-assisted controls, and tech that feels ripped straight out of concept car. And here's the kicker. While Ferrari builds art pieces for millionaires, BYD built the U9 to prove one thing. China isn't just copying anymore. It's leading. The Yangwon U9 is China's calling card to the world. We're here. We're faster. And we're changing the game. The age of Western dominance in supercars may be coming to an end. For decades, Europe owned the throne. But BYD is rewriting the narrative. With their electric dominance, battery expertise, and now the U9, China is saying, the future of supercars belongs to us, and the world is watching. Tesla, Ferrari, Bugatti, they all have reason to be worried. Because the Yangwon U9 is proving that supercars don't have to follow tradition. They can evolve. The challenges. Now, let's be real. The U9 isn't perfect. Its price tag, over $230,000, puts it in hypercar territory. It's also untested in the real world. And while the jumping feature looks spectacular, critics ask, is it practical or just a flashy trick? Will it stand the test of time or fade like a gimmick? The future of supercars. But whether you call it genius or a gimmick, one thing is clear. The Yangwon U9 is a line in the sand. A car that dares to leap, literally, into the future. A machine that forces the world to admit. China is not just catching up, it's overtaking. So the next time you hear the roar of a Ferrari or the scream of a Lamborghini, remember, there's a new sound coming from the east. The sound of a supercar that jumps. So here's the big question. Is the BYD Yang Wang U9 the future of supercars? Or just the beginning of something even bigger? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Because the revolution has already begun. I see you rolling up over black Cadillac, high heel boots and a sexy body.